Hello humans, this is Dr. Kai, and Zero Skill has just messaged me about literally the purpose of this video. This I'm going to respond to him after the video, don't worry, I won't make you wait for that. But, if you would like to see what I've done, I've created a tool that basically has given me more joy than any other tool that I've ever made. I've managed to import all of my jumps into Elite. As you can see, I'm filtering by visited stars, so the blue ones are places I've been. and. That's something that's new in 2.2 slash 1.7, but unfortunately, it only counts jumps that happen after 2.2, at least automatically. I've created a tool that lets you import them, and now, basically, I can trace all of my routes out into the black. So, for example, this is my very first expedition out to Sagittarius A, and you can just trace it, it goes all the way there. And this is Distant Worlds, this is us hanging around Fine Ring Nebula. It's absolutely amazing. So what is it, how does it work? Let me show you. It's called ED System Importer. Unfortunately I couldn't make it portable because it requires some SQL editing libraries. What you basically do is you click, depending on where your jumps are stored, most of them are stored in log files, but if you've been storing them in Captain's Log or ED Discovery, which by the way, these two programs now also export jumps into Elite. But in case you've uninstalled them or you just want to do it all together or whatever, you do that, you find your jumps. It should take you straight to the full up folder, but I've made a custom one. There's one there. Um, ED Discovery, the only one you need to do is the first SQLite file, so that one, for example. You can add some log files, so let's say that one. And if you ever move computer and you want to import your new jumps, they're now stored in player journals, you can do that. Then you hit import and it will now say it's in the correct folder start up ED and enter the game and wait for the jumps to come in that bit you shouldn't be doing this with ED running which I have just done by the way um, but basically yes then when you start ED uh, go to the galaxy map wait a few minutes and you should see all your jumps coming in you'll know it's finished because this file actually exists oh by the way I've got a new 4 terabyte hard drive for recording I can record life itself I've also mounted it in such a way that I don't need to rename my folder my my, uh, I mounted it as my game capture folder basically. Sorry, rambling, rambling. Okay, what was I saying? Yes, you, it's actually stored in app, lo app data, local, fronted development, elite dangerous, and in one of these folders. So there you go, imported stars. Um, that's what it just created, this. Um, it, and it's just a list of all your jumps from all those files. Um, it can be very big, this one's 245 kilobytes. Um, when you start the game, it will slowly import them into visited star cache.dat, and then it will rename it to imported stars of text dot imported I've already done it I don't need that and that's when you know it's done and you're safe and you can basically back this up um, and take it to other computers and you might have two in two different folders if you do this will ask you to check which one um, I think that they're separated by which account you account you use so you might have two accounts and have two visited star dot visited stars cache dot dats um, and it will ask you which one to choose and you'll have to look at like date and some clues and stuff but I can't really help you with that and by the way to install it you click install it downloads a setup file um, and yeah it will install very quickly all by itself it might prompt you with Windows smart screen you just click to um, allow that there is an option to do that there it's a bit hidden but you'll find it but yeah, if you want the source code, I'm happy to send it over, so just be in touch. And I hope this transforms your Elite game forever, as it has mine. I'm just so immensely satisfied to see all that, and to find all my old routes. My very first route, all the way to Sada, for example, I found that. That was a year and a half ago. It's, it's just stunning, okay? Um, yeah, so yeah, let's check the description for the downloads. And this is a 7 o'clock in the morning video, so if I'm a bit groggy, so long, humans! See what secrets they hold. Join me as I sail amongst the stars.